Hello YouTubers! So, uh, you might have remembered me that I recently just switched out my power supply um, because I bought the Corsair uh, TX750 and I swapped it out of... So this is my old power supply. And what I'm going to do today is I'm going to open it up and I'm going to see if there's any um, leaky capacitors. And usually that's what causes um, hardware failure. Uh, leaky capacitors and with the Corsair, they guarantee that the uh, capacitors they have are the highest grade of uh, Japanese capacitors. So anyways, I'm going to unscrew this and I'll open it up and s see if there's anything off with it. So I just uh, unscrewed the, uh, the box here. See that? So make sure you get all the screws here. Here, 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 there, there. And there's actually another screw up there. But. So, I'm going to take it apart and uh, see if there's anything uh, off with the power supply. And, uh, yeah. Now, if you want to watch the video where I swapped my um, Corsair with this one, um, please, uh, it's in my channel, so uh, you can watch it on the, on the link there. So, so I just unpopped the, I popped the plastic, uh, well, the metal part off here. And it is pretty dusty. So, this is the best way to clean your power supply as well, so so make sure you, all these come off. Check the fan here. Here's that, I think it's a 135 millimeter fan, so. And, look at that. It is pretty dusty, so. Now I'm going to take a look at the capacitors here, so hopefully you can take a look at that as well. See if there's anything off with it. I don't see anything off with it right now, but I'm going to make sure here. It might just need a good cleaning, so. And the way to find out if your capacitors are off is that these things will pop upwards. So, um, thanks for watching my video. Now, please subscribe to the channel for more updates. And um, if you have any questions, post any comments below. And um, you can always check out my other channel. And uh, please subscribe.